Hey, what's up guys? My name is Emma. Today I'll be reacting to Higurashi When They Cry, new episode 5. I want to get started on this episode on the count of 3, 2, 1, now. I had a feeling this was gonna happen. Too many of them were gone. <laughs> You're finally getting how our club works, huh? Okay. Okay. They were going through the credits there too, so it's pretty possible that there's no opening then? Such a big mood shift from last episode at least. Okay. Okay. <laughs> you have competition. Okay. They're all split up. She straight has a gun on her. We'll see what happens. Sorry for the ex uh, extra noise. Tomita? Okamoto? Are they playing life? Jesus, yeah, you're about to lose. Yes, yes it is. What's happening? Okay, well, she's going on for sure. That she did. What game was she playing? They're like, we're out, see you when it's over. <laughs> oh no. Yeah, it's the cards there. They're letting her win. She's just going to get this win. Yeah. It's all up to you, KG. Are you going to win this? Mm-hmm. Yeah, I was literally about to say, go bankrupt, or something. It's his luck. Oh my. 
my god. <laughs> okay, Rika, what's up? Instantly, pretty much. Are you in debt? It is pretty true. His luck's definitely rely- oh. Come on, D.A.G. <laughs> Come on, you got this. Come on, guys. Let's go. No, he's he's gonna do it. Let's see. No. Come on. Don't stoop this low. You're in it to show off. You want to beat the others. You're in it for victory. Mm -hmm. He just doesn't want to get in trouble. Rika. Wow. No. No. That is... <laughs> KG. You are making promises you shouldn't. Useful days of mine have been so gloomy. You can try, I guess, but... No. <laughs> Come on. You, you need to catch on, guys. Something's not right about that. It is possible to turn that game around. I've seen it happen. I play board games all the time, but... What? <laughs> what? It's time for you- okay. Yoshiro. Of course. Ha! No, it's terrifying. That's what that is. Give it to me, on. Okay. <laughs> uh. 
Oh my god, stop. She's like, yeah, not his thing. The 13th of June. Angel Mort. Okay. Yep. <laughs> Infamous. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> Great job. That's... Yep. Hmm. <laughs> Keiji, no! You just slapped your... You whacked your dad because of that... So... Oh my god. The faces. It's the uniform. It is a requirement. But yeah. Yeah. Mm hmm. It's Xion. Yes, because you look pretty identical. Hmm. Okay. I'm all like... Sh They're twins! You're an idiot. <laughs> Kate Chan, yeah. I'm just waiting. This feels like way too. I don't even know the right word. Into a competition? Oh, but she got serious about this. Wow. Just dump the salt in. Helping your uncle. Someone. Completely different. Uh, 
Okay. Mm hmm Okay. <laughs> it's true, we got to see his... Okay, who's at the door? Okay. No, you're definitely not bothering him. He has trust issues thinking it's a prank. I just have trust issues. <laughs> but I don't think that would happen. Hmm. Okay. She's getting very... You're spreading the news. That? Yeah. Um, Rika? Okay. Tia Sensei. I, yeah. <laughs> hey, you're the one who's... <laughs> Very true. Man, she's getting told off by Chia Sensei in the background. Devilishly beautiful some woman someday, okay. Yeah, I don't think she she paid her to say anything of that. Where are you going to go with this? Yes, what does that mean for you? Yeah, but we'll never continue that thought. Okay. Okay, yeah. It's Sunday, you know? Uh... 
on Sunday. Mm hmm. Hot and drifting. <laughs> Dragging her away. Probably. Going back to Angel Lore. You bumped the... Of course! It happens, but yeah. Ooh, okay. I don't think you guys want to deal with that. That's not... You don't want to be in that situation. Everyone's eyes. Ah, oh, it's over. Ah, oh, Cage, you're finding yourself in not great situations, man. So we're back before the festival, but we're having more of a focus on Mion. I almost said Chion. Uh, but I don't know, because yeah, Rika definitely looked older at the beginning of episode two. I think it was. And then things progressed. But yeah. Mion Shion. Twin sister. Not even Raina knew about. And they went into the discussion of how they can be the complete opposites from looks. But. I'm wondering, since this obviously seems to be like a reset, just, you know, it's not, they're not all identical. What could... Mm. Cotton Deceiving Chapter Part 2. Mm. That's terrifying. Um, but I guess we're going to have to work with that. Let's get into talking about the episode a little bit. Um... Oh, by the way, I forgot to mention in the beginning, I'm so sorry about the lack of, like, you know, actual video on the YouTube channel. Something happened, it, it always seems to happen at times, and I just greatly apologize for that nonsense. Uh, I will try to not let that happen again. But no promises, because it, it shouldn't have, but it occurs. I don't know. It's, it's like this chapter where he, it's not even like Keiichi seems like to have 100% faith in Reina again. It's like, it starts off all, you know, back to normal, like all cutesy and like slice of life. And they're just doing their club and all of that. There's a train going by. But when they're having, like, this discussion, I'll talk back about the games in a bit. 
but when they're having the discussion at the desk about like personalities and you can't judge a book by its cover when it comes to Rana asking Keiichi what he thinks of her he had this thought and you know he did explain himself and all of this but then he also immediately was like well then what does that make you if you're the opposite of what I'm saying what I'm seeing I don't know it's weird it's very weird in saying that she, uh, Satoko is very sweet and needy. That, um, Mion's actually very cute and girly. Which I would believe. It, it, it is very notorious for there to be situations where you'll have to, like, you know, act a certain way to try fitting the role you think you need to be. But, I don't... It's just, we're, we're getting introduced to Xion here. You know, the twin sister, who it doesn't seem like, you know, Reina knew about. Never met her. And, you know. Uh, Satoko and Rika didn't really comment much about Keiichi bringing Xion up. Is something I noticed. They did go and poke fun at Mion for how, like, blushy she's being and all of that. But they didn't really draw attention to the Xion comments or anything like that. So that's a little draw thing to take from, I guess. Any information's information. But I guess I want to kind of keep this short in a way. Um, So I'm going to go back to when they're doing the games and how all of them were like, see you guys at the finals. And so... Literally everyone wins within like the first minute of the game and then they're judge well me on judging um Keiichi for they all were in a way jokingly and poking fun at him but for losing this game which is really highly luck based uh there are probably some tips and tricks on certain things in some games but I don't know that game seemed purely spin it you deal with it um so he goes and makes a deal with the two uh, guys. Also, is this like a form of karta? Because, you know, he wasn't like using tone. It was like just reading the f statements out. And then um, the person's going to slap the card to get it. And of course, Reyna's just going to go in because of the cute cards. Um, yeah, all of them in a way had their way of winning. Rika literally, she just had the fan club. So she got through that really easy. Um, but for Keiichi, he ends up bribing them. Yeah. I don't know how well that's gonna actually work out for you. But, yeah. Like, it's just hard to think about. What's gonna happen next year? You can give it to anyone, and they wouldn't be flustered. They'd accept it. And then he goes to give it to she uh, Mion! But okay. The last few episodes were really drawing attention to Reyna, but we did see moments with uh, Mion too. My brain's just trying to take the information we do know and theorize what it could possibly be now. And that's really all my mind's at, I guess. So I'm sorry I don't have a lot to talk about for this episode. This is really the, like, reset up. Like, this is setting up what's what events are probably going to come in the next few days for them. And I am a little scared to find out what's coming next for them, but I'm also still intrigued. But I would like to know your thoughts. Um, you know, no spoilery stuff, because while I think I probably know some stuff, this is not a remake, so there's still stuff for me to like learn from it and all of that, but yeah, yeah. <laughs> I really don't have much to say, apparently. I'm just here. Um, I also have something else to record. That can be it, too. But thank you guys for watching. I hope you have a great day or night, whenever the heck you're watching this. And uh, I'm sorry for the delay. Things happen, I guess. <clears throat> but have a great day. Bye-bye.